that's just what I do when I'm out So try not to hold me down Feel alive Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica if you are new here. So for today's video, I think I'm going to do a like get to know me tag. Basically, I have filmed this video and throughout the years that I've been on YouTube, like four years or whatever, I have filmed this video probably a total of like six or seven times. Every time I would come back to YouTube, like come back to YouTube or whatever, I would film it and then I just would never upload it. I would hate it. Hopefully, this is like, what, the seventh time maybe? Like, seventh time's the charm? I don't know. I remember filming this when I was like 16, okay? Basically, the get to know me tag is like a YouTube tag that people used to do like way back when in like 2013, 2014. It's like the OG thing to do. Um, so I figured, why not bring it back? With all that being said, I just googled, um, YouTube get to know me tag questions. This was the first one that popped up. It's the 2019 version, so we'll see. But I'm just gonna get into it. I don't think there's anything else to say, so. First question, where did you grow up? I'm not actually gonna say the name of the town, but I did grow up in Indiana. Um, it's a very small town. There's nothing to do there at all. I don't live there anymore, but yeah, it was a good place to grow up. Where do you currently live? I currently live in a suburb of Indianapolis. How tall are you? I'm 5'4", so I feel like that's pretty average. Um, dogs or cats? Dogs, 100%. I love dogs so much. What year were you born? I was born in 1999, so 90s baby. Woohoo. Are you in slash have you gone to college? If you watch my channel, you should know I am in college and I go to Ball State University. What's your favorite drink? Sweet tea. Hands down. Love sweet tea so much. You're wearing perfume. What scent is it? I actually don't wear perfume. The last perfume that I had was like a One Direction perfume. I, I never wear perfume at all. What are your life goals? Ooh, we're getting to the deep questions now. Um, life goals. That's a really good question. I don't know. One of my big goals, okay, is to like actually pursue this dream of mine of like YouTube and like the influencer community which is such a like controversial dream to have like people look down upon it so much but not gonna lie like it is my dream like some people want to be actresses or like filmmakers or songwriters or musicians like this is my big dream so we'll see here I'm out here like trying my best now finally so Another life goal, obviously like I want to get married and I want to have like two kids, more life goals, what else? I would love to have a beach house, I don't know, that's like so expensive and crazy but I would love to have like a beach house that we can go to. Another thing, wow I have so many goals, I thought I didn't have any, I have so many. Um, I really want to travel the world, like I want, there are so many places I want to go. What sports do you play or have you played? Currently, don't play any sports because I am not athletic. Um, throughout school, I've played soccer in kindergarten. I was a cheerleader for a while, gymnastics, and then I was in color guard, which another controversial, is it a sport, is it not? I don't know, I guess it's a performing art, but you get hurt way too much, so. There's that. Have any books you've read changed your life? I read Anxious for Nothing, which was a really good book. I can't remember who wrote it, but it was really, really good. Currently, I'm reading Girl, Wash Your Face. I'm like one chapter in and I'm already like so motivated. So we'll see, but yeah. Uh, what's your favorite movie? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not the biggest movie person. I really like Disney movies, which I know is like looked down upon sometimes, but I love Disney. I love Aladdin and Lady and the Tramp. Okay, I loved how all the boys I loved before. Like, I don't know. Honestly, I'm just not the biggest like movie person. Who are your favorite YouTubers? I said this in my previous video. This changes so much. Currently, I love Sam and Colby, Shane Dawson, Kyle Paolo, Emily Enchanted. Those are probably my top, like, right now. Do you speak any languages and how well? I speak English barely. As you can tell from my YouTube channel, it's rough. Are you single or taken? I am single, so. At, um, who do I want to date? Colby Brown? Harry Styles? Hit me up. I'm single. <laughs> um, what's your idea of a dream date? Can we go to the beach? <laughs> 
<laughs> let's go to the beach for a date. I'm landlocked in Indiana, but let's go to the beach. How long was your longest relationship? Zero days and zero hours and zero seconds. So. How would you describe your fashion sense? Trendy, probably. I'm really bad at like sticking to a certain fashion style, which is fine, I think. I think sometimes we get caught up in the idea that we have to like fit in a box. And I think it's okay to like dress differently and in, in different like styles. The one I guess I keep coming back to is trendy because I, I absolutely love to hop on the trends. As you guys may know, I pick up on the trends so quickly, <laughs> it's kind of embarrassing. What's your go-to hairstyle? Probably naturally curly because it's so easy. Um, I have really curly hair and it's very hard to like straighten and like like this I love how this looks sometimes but it's so much work like how to straighten my hair and then go through and like wand it how many siblings do you have I have one I have a half brother what is your go-to fast food order I don't really like fast food but if I had to choose like just your basic old cheeseburger and fries or chicken nuggets and fries. I struggle with like greasy foods. It really like makes me feel sick. So I try not to eat um, fast food too much, but yeah. PC or Mac? Mac. Most memorable vacation? Probably the time I went to the beach for the first time with my parents and my best friend. That was probably like most memorable va vacation. It was really fun. Also, I went to Disney World twice actually with my best friend, but first time we went with her family, which was really fun on Thanksgiving. Second time it was just us two, like our first time like traveling without a parent, it was just us. So that was probably um, up there as well. What are your morning evening routines? I'll actually make a video about this very soon. So I'm not gonna go into it because that would be very long. Um, if you wanna see my previous morning or evening or whatever routines I'll link them whichever side it's on um but yeah I'll be making like a summer morning and night routine very soon so stay tuned for that do you have any bad habits uh yeah procrastinating being lazy when I need to be doing things um watching way too much YouTube I could go on and on I am literally a mess um saying literally too much Talking with my hands, oh, it kills me when I'm editing because all I do is talk with my hands. Tell us one thing we wouldn't know about you. Like, if you've never met me in real life, probably wouldn't know that I'm like very shy and introverted because on camera, I'm like, I talk, like it's just me. So I'm not afraid to talk or say like whatever. When I first meet people, I am so unbelievably like shy and introverted such a problem um, and it takes me like a while to like get to know people and like open up to them so that's it okay we went through those super quickly so I'm going to move on to the extended version fancy extended version here we go what's your favorite Netflix show honestly I haven't watched Netflix in so long like I said because I live on YouTube like that's all I watch um, I really was into the Carrie Diaries for a while. Of course, I loved The Office. I did watch like Gossip Girl for a while. I watched 90210 like back in the day, but other than that, oh, One Tree Hill. I loved One Tree Hill until they took Lucas off of the show. That was, that made me salty. Show us your song tabs on Spotify. I don't know what that means at all, but I can tell you that I listened to, um, a lot of Harry Styles, Ben Rector, Niall, and Country. Like, that's what I listen to. Also, Lauren Daigle, Hillsong Worship. Like, that's basically what I listen to. What's the craziest thing you've done? Talk to a camera for hours on end. <laughs> I don't know. I don't do, like, crazy things ever. Ever. Describe your first crush. My first crush was in kindergarten. I don't remember his name, but I remember he had blonde hair. That's all I know. That's literally all I know. What theme parks have you been to? Disney World and Great Wolf. Is Great Wolf Lodge a theme park? No, no, it's a water park. Just Disney World. I don't like roller coasters. They make me nauseous. So Disney World is about the only place you'll get me to go. What was your dream job as a kid? So I actually used to want to be a veterinarian or a teacher. That was like what I wanted to do. Um, as we can see, <laughs> neither of those happened. So that's okay though. 
What's your coffee order? Nothing. I don't like coffee at all. Have you ever failed at anything and what did you learn? Um, yeah, I failed at so many things. I'm really bad about like keeping my New Year's resolutions. Uh, like this year I wanted to take two days a week off social media. And I wanted to like read every single night before bed and I like abandoned that by the end of January. Who is your celebrity crush? Um, I have so many. First of all, Harry Styles. Second of all, probably Niall. Then also Colby Brock. Don't ask me why, but I love him. Like, okay, he is gorgeous. Those are probably my top. I literally have so many. It's unbelievable. Um, Cole Sprouse, KJ Appa, like, perfect. Anyway, <laughs> moving on from that. Do you have any pets? Show them to us. Yes, I have a dog. His name is Oscar. I'll put pictures in here. He's actually over there sleeping right now, so I don't want to, like, get him up. But he's the best. I love him so, so much. What are your pet peeves? Lying? I can't stand when people lie. When people like judge your life, like recently I've gotten so much crap for only working a certain number of hours a week like at my job. Like everyone has something negative to say about it and it drives me crazy. Like it doesn't affect you. It's not you that's like making the money or not making the money. Like just let me live my life. Why do you care? Like people that judge you for what you post on social media, oh, that drives me nuts. Like, if you don't like what I post, unfollow me. Like, no problem, but don't, like, judge me for posting something or, like, writing something, like, ugh. Next question, what do you do in your free time? This is what I do in my free time. What's your favorite color? Gray, gold, and blue. Can you tell? Do you know your personality type? Um, no, I know that I'm an Enneagram type 6, and I know that I am an INFP, so that's what I know, woohoo. Have you been to any concerts or festivals? Which were the most memorable? I have been to so many concerts. I love, love, love concerts so much. I like thrive at, at concerts and at the beach, like that's two places that I just thrive. Most memorable, One Direction in Nashville. In one direction in Indianapolis. Those, no concert will ever top those. What are your favorite values and friends? Trust and like humor and just um, like compassion. How do you get along with your family? Very well. I love my family so much. Last question, finally. This is a long video. Um, what are you happiest with in your life? Okay, I have a couple things. First of all is the fact that I'm like growing in my faith. Second of all, the fact that I am like, I don't care to put myself online and like actually pursue this like influencer thing because four years ago I was terrified. Like you would never ever catch me posting about my YouTube on my Instagram where like people from school could see. But now I'm like, hey everyone, go watch this that's probably like the two things that i'm like super happy about in my life right now i think that's all i have that that was all the questions i'm sorry if this video was very long that was a lot of questions and i'm sorry if i talked really fast it was a lot of questions and i wanted to get through it rather quickly so i hope you enjoyed this video if you have any more questions about me or like things i didn't answer leave them in the comments and i'll respond to them make sure to subscribe turn on my post notifications and follow me on Instagram because I'm doing a giveaway literally like right now. So my camera stopped recording. But anyway, go check out my giveaway on Instagram. And I think that's all I have to say. So I will see you on today's Wednesday. I will see you on Friday for a brand new video. So yeah. Bye guys. One, two, one, two, three. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall.